Hey everyone, you are really going to like this episode. If you are a mom and pop landlord or you're managing your own stuff, Dana from Hemlane is going to show us how her platform allows you to facilitate advertising your listings. So Dana, I'm going to let you take over and start driving and ask a bunch of questions. Great. Sounds good. Um, so one of the questions we get a lot is where should I advertise my property? Right. Um, that's like Question number one, um, based on where you advertise your property is going to have a huge impact on how many tenants are interested. I mean, if you go and put it on, um, you know, for rent one, two, three dot com, which is a website from the 1980s no. um, that no one is really using. Right. Um, you're not going to you're not going to get the leads um, that you need. So the first thing to do is do what a tenant would do. Go on to Google and search, you know, rentals, rental properties in Denver. Uh, what are the top three websites that show up on Google search? Those are the ones you want to make sure that you're on, right? Yep. Every market is going to be a little bit different, um, but most of them, it's the same websites taking over, you know, Zillow, Apartment List, Apartments.com, Zumper. Um, Facebook Marketplace is actually an interesting one that hasn't been um, on Google search, but tenants are searching there. And in some markets, hmm. it's super hot. Other markets, it's not. Um, but there's some markets where you, you would be shocked by how many Facebook market leads you get. Um, so we work with both apartments, um, uh, single family condos, et cetera. So if you have a listing on here, what you can see is where we advertise it to directly on here. Hmm. And we have partner websites. All of these are ones and every market's a little bit different, but you can wow. click on these and see your listing on all of these websites. So you click, you swipe it on and you get those so, ones. So real, I just want to make sure I understand the connection. So you come to Hemlane, you put in your pictures, your rental rate, what you look for, blah, blah, blah. You hit some magic button somewhere and it goes to yep. all these places. <laughs> Yep, you swipe it to on, it goes to all these places. Um, oh so we'll go to all of these and more. It's about 30 we do. Um, but really, 30 is more of a marketing thing. Really, in every single market, there's a couple that matter, like um, a Zumper's super hot, um, Zillow's super hot, Realtor.com mm. super hot. There's a couple that are really interesting. And that's why I say if you put it in Google search, you'll see those first five on the first page are really the only ones that matter. Um, it's more of a marketing thing to say, Hey, it goes to all of these other ones. Right. I, I really like this. So can, so what are my inputs? Right. Cause again, I'm going to come here as mom and pop. I'm going to have my pictures. What, what are, let's yes. see what they fill out. So it's all the stuff that you would think of, right? What's the address? When is it available? What's the rate deposit? What else? Minimum exactly. credit requirement. Oh, I love this. Yeah, we put minimum credit income like three to um uh, three times rent. So this will automatically calculate it. So if you change it to like two point five, it will change it. Yeah. Um, and then here um, with the duration, we try to give tips. Like for example, if it's a winter turnover and you're in a really cold place, you probably don't want a twelve month lease. You might put twelve months, but in the lease agreement, you might change it and say, hey, let's do an eighteen month lease and mm. lock it into that price to try to get closer to summer turnover. Uh -huh. um, you'll have the listing information, most things like features and stuff. Oh, let me just save my changes there. Mm -hmm. um, features like heat included electricity, everything's the checkbox. Tenants do not read, do not put anything in paragraph form. Mm -hmm. They don't like it, right? Yeah. Um, do you allow pets? So like small dogs allowed, um, you know, no cats allowed. You can go through. Yeah, cats, no cats. <laughs> Yeah, there you go. Um, so you, you can go through this process and, and um, check all the boxes and then it puts websites. Um, and then the other important thing is actually the pictures. If I go to pictures, one thing I always yeah, recommend pictures. is if you have a washer and dryer in the unit, take a picture of it, um, right? Uh, if you have a garage, yeah. take a picture of it. Tenants are visual. They look, they love pictures. They're on like Instagram and Facebook all day looking at pictures. They love pictures of things. Yeah. You know, that's a great point because again, back to our conversation, number two, things that drive rent. And we talked about parking, at least in my area, right? Earlier, you showed us a checkbox. that could have said garage. Most tenants aren't going to see that, but if you take a picture of the garage, yeah, that is, that's a great tip. Oh, I like that. Yeah. And, and washers and dryers are the big one where even you'll see when I click view listing up here, you can see what it would look like on all the listing uh, web pages. Ah. You'll see here and you can click on the photos and see what they look like. But with it, 
will have, you know, anything you checked. These are things I just checked here mm -hmm. on there. But again, at the end of the day, the, um, uh, the tenants are going to um, just look at the pictures first. And so yeah. that's the most important thing. And then I saw um, you had there ask questions. I assume that would route to whoever you want it to, right? Yeah, that routes to whoever you want it to. You can also set up showing schedules. So I could say I'm going nice. to do showings and I'm going to do showings every Saturday at 10 a.m. Huh. And I'm going to do it every Saturday and I can schedule those showings. Interesting. And then when I do, I'll just go ahead and refresh this. Um, that goes to those and they can go ahead and schedule showings. Hmm. And then when they sign uh -huh. up, it actually asks the pre-qualification questions. So I had said my credit score <laughs> and my income was this. I want yes or no. I like the it. Worst, the worst thing for you, especially as a landlord, uh, but property managers and agents as well, you don't want to spend your Saturday going to a showing at 10 a.m. just to find out the person is not qualified. Exactly. Right. Um, so I always say, fill this out, but also call them. If you're going to drive on over there and waste their time and your time, because their time's important as well, mm -hmm. you want to make sure this person is um, going to qualify. Um, and like I said, there's creative ways of that, of, oh, you don't meet these, do you have a co-signer? Potentially something like that. Um, but you do want to make sure that they meet your um, requirements. If they say their expected move-in date is in six months, also probably don't want to go out there um, and um, show them the place. Like um, so that. those are, we basically go through a checklist of items here. Once you have it all done, um, then you can go and see what your listing would look like on those listing websites. But then all the leads come directly into our system. So we have with all of these partners, direct integrations with them. There's a couple, um, uh, these ones here actually charge for show, uh, listings now. Zillow, Truly, and Hotpads used to be free. Mm. It used to be, you could list on the website. It was free. Um, it used to be down here. Um, we actually just moved it up here because they put a paywall onto their um, software. Oh, and so it's up here. Um, and uh, those are the price that they charge. We just charge um, the customer for to use it. And then you get these if you're a part of that premium. It's $89 mm. for 30 days. Okay. And it lists to those websites as well. You can choose to do that, or you can just choose to use the standard websites. Mm -hmm. Ones like Facebook Marketplace go directly through through Zumper. So we have um, direct partnerships to other feeds and stuff like that. Um, the only one where you, I would say, know your market and know whether it's on there is Craigslist is the only one that doesn't have APIs and hates technology companies and doesn't want to work <laughs> with them. Um, you can copy this code and then click on this Craigslist post and post it on there. So all your bullet points and oh, stuff like that. There. So cool. you can do that, but know your market. Some markets, people say Craigslist works really well. Um, and others say you don't need it. Everyone's looking. Yeah. Up what I, my have. experience with Craigslist is it was a valid, I don't know what do you call it, platform five years ago. We got, we, we, I don't think we've gotten a good Craigslist app in two years. Yep. Probably. It, and, and with Craigslist, you'll have a lot of more scams, right? Um, we've yeah. seen you listed on Craigslist, suddenly your ad gets copied and at a lower price and someone's calling you crying because uh, they gave yeah. them a security deposit. And you said that wasn't us who posted that. Yeah, so there's crazy. certain things like that that you definitely um, want to be um, on top of. Yeah, folks, this, is, this, is, this part of the application is something you need to play with. Uh, there's still a 30-day trial, right? Yeah, exactly. So if you have a vacant property, try it for free. There's no cost to use this. Yeah. 30 day trial. And again, if they like what they have, there's still that, uh, I don't know, coupon code or discount code Zuber. Zuber, Z-U-B-E-R, uh, capital Z. Yeah. Very, very cool. So again, if you want to sign up, you can get a discount. I think it's 20%, right? Yep. 20% off your um, first year of your monthly subscription. Um, so you just put that code in there and um, cool. you're all set to go. Yeah, folks, again, there's a lot here. We've been covering it every other week. Go back, watch the playlist. Hemlane has a playlist on my channel. I think this marketing platform is something you need to play with. If you have a vacancy, take their 30-day trial, play with it, see what it's like. You got to get leads. You got to get appointments. Uh, it's very, very slick. Dana, very nice job with this. Very impressed. Great. Thanks so much. You got it.